Bye guys, it's Darkness for Life here, and like I promised, I will do a, a booster pack opening. So, I'm going for Fiend and Light Swan deck, and a bit of Kaiba Joey. Uh, and then I might get some Yusei's packs as well. So let's start with Bakura, I'll open 10 packs, so yeah, let's go. Mm, all of them I already have, but still not bad, not bad. Missed Archfiend, that's an interesting card, I have 3 copies of it already, but still, it's definitely one of the better ones. Okay, I don't know on how many packs did I open, but I'll just open 3 more after this one, and that will be it for Bakura. And then I'll open some Joey Kaiba and Yugi, because those are the better packs, if you wanna like, get a Red Eyes deck, get a Blue Eyes deck, get a Dragon deck, or just get a Magician deck. This card is actually quite decent. Okay, yeah, this card is worth it. Okay, my last pack, what am I going to get? Um, okay, Pelican Archfiend, no bad, no bad. Let me open three Joey packs. Hmm, nothing too good, uh, okay, this is an interesting one, this one, I might actually use a ritual summoning deck, I might, okay, the masked beast, uh, okay, I'll open no more, whatever, because like you can see in the top right corner, I have a bunch of coins, okay, yeah, this was worth it, I'll open the free kyber packs, Nothing too new, but still not bad. The cards are, I guess, okay. Yeah, this is good, even though I have probably... I have three copies of it, but if I would count all of mine, I'd probably have like 20. Okay, this card was actually one of the cards that I wanted to get from Kaiba, so I'm happy about this. Let me open five Yugi packs, because you know it's Yugi. Come on. Uh, I never got this card before, so that's good. I already have most of the strongest cards, but still. I have like probably 20 copies of the Sphinx. Oh god. Three more. Yay, cool Rebo! Do that la. Uh, the Yu Gi Oh! Bridge is so funny. <laughs> like, uh, the cool Rebo says, do that la, motherfucker. Like, <laughs> You should actually check out Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridge. It's so funny then. Um, okay, I didn't get anything like too good. I got a decent card, I guess, but I won't see. Okay, now let's go on to... If you want to build a cyber deck, you actually should go for Cyrus Truesdale. I already have a cyber deck and a cyber dark deck. Which I will be uploading sometime soon. Yep, as a future monster. I'll open like two more packs of this. I'll show you like the main, uh, the main ones that I get cards from. It's like Yugi, Kaiba, Joey, Bakura, uh, then the Osiris, and then Bastion. If you wanna build a zombie vampire deck, Bastion will give you most of the cards that you can get from there. Okay, let me open two more packs just to show you. Okay, he's not giving me anything now. Oh, wow. Okay, one more. Come on, just give me that zombie, whatever, any zombie monster. Okay, he's not gonna give me any zombie monsters. What an asshole. 
Okay, the next one is gonna be for Light Swarm. So, for Light Swarm, you have to go to Akiza. And I will open uh, 10 to 12 packs of Akiza. Because I, I wanna build a Light Swarm deck. Even though I have so many points, I could never be bothered to actually do it. And I probably don't even have the right cards to do it. I, I need like three copies of the Judgment Dragon and I only have either one, either none. Probably none though. Akisa's deck in my opinion is actually quite bad. Like, uh, the cards that she uses are quite simple, easy predictable and you can easily counter someone using her deck. With any type of deck, a power deck, a uh, defensive deck, or just a uh, switch, sync, or whatever, XYZ. I haven't even played one, I haven't even, my Zexel campaigns like on one, on 2%, but my Yu-Gi-Oh! Duo Monsters, the original, the best one, uh, I have it done, I think, on about... Uh, 100% and then 5DS is 100% and then GX is like 60 I might do some Yu-Gi-Oh challenges as well because I have everything unlocked for Duo Monsters and for 5DS Okay, I'm gonna do some Jack Hatless as well. Why not? Why not? I'm gonna use up 10 more thousand but no more than that because uh, I know some of you might say oh use up all your stuff but I'm one of those people who just likes to have it, just cause he has it, J just to have it, like, if if the new packs will come out someday or something like that, I can just have the extra, I don't know, those points, whatever. Okay, and now I'm gonna hit Crow for 5 packs, cause I might actually... In the last game, I actually had a, a similar deck, uh, a Blackwing deck. It was actually the OP. But in this game, I don't have one, so I might make one later on, but definitely not now. Because it takes a lot of time. And I cannot be bothered. I want to build a Light Swan deck, so I need a Light and Dragon, I believe. And a Dark and Dragon, just for my Fiend deck as well. So, and those cards you can get from Yusei, so I'll hit Yusei for like 10 deck, 10 packs I think, and that will wrap up the video probably. Okay, I already have this card. Okay, the first pack, what do we have? Uh, Shooting Star Dragon, okay, I don't have that card, so I guess that's good, but I'm not gonna use a Stardust in any of my decks. I just don't like that card in my opinion. It's really overpowered if you have the Assault Mode uh, Stardust, but otherwise it's actually not a really powerful card, otherwise. I could probably quite easily make a Yusei deck if I want to. Okay guys, I'm back, uh, okay, I didn't get any cards that I actually wanted from Yusei, but, uh, I guess I got some newer cards. I can implement some of the synchros and stuff into my deck, I guess. 
Uh, junk Berserk, I don't really need a card. Okay, after this I'll open one more pack and that will end the booster pack opening, guys. Okay, I never had this one, so that's good. Oh, the salt mode. Okay, guys, if you enjoyed, smack the like button, subscribe, comment, share the video. And if you want more, uh, comment below that you want more booster packs opening. And I will upload a deck today as well. See ya, peace.